Okay, in this problem, we are asked to determine A when there's a function h of st equals s squared t minus a times s squared t squared. And we know that the total derivative of h at the point 1, 3 with respect to the vector negative 2, 5 is equal to 11. So first we're going to utilize the second equation to see that Eleven is equal to the gradient vector of h at the point one three, dotted with the vector negative two five, and we know that the gradient vector is just partial derivative of h with respect to s at the point 1, 3 as the first component, and the second component is the partial derivative of h with respect to t at the point 1, 3. And now we can compute this dot product. And we get that negative 2 times h with respect to s at 1, 3 plus 5 times h with respect to t at the point 1, 3 is equal to 11. So we can't really do anything more here, but we have the function h in terms of s, t, and a. So we can calculate the partial derivative of h with respect to s in terms of s, t, and a. And we see that h with respect to s is equal to 2st minus 2as times t squared. And h with respect to t is s squared minus 2a times s squared t. Now we know that the point that we want it evaluated at is 1, 3. So we can go ahead and do that. And we see that h with respect to s at 1, 3 is 6 minus 18a. And h with respect to t at 1, 3 is 1 minus 6a. So we can plug these into our given equation here. We see that negative 12 plus 5 is negative 7, plus 18a minus 30a.
So this is plus 36a. So we see that bringing the 7 over to this side and um, simplifying. We get that 6a equals 18 and a equals 3. 